forecast. This day started off very cold across the area. Coldest weather in quite some time. It warmed up a little bit this afternoon, kind of setting the trend for this week. Mainly dry week weather this week. Perhaps not in the east tomorrow. There could be a stray shower in some of our eastern counties, so we'll include that. But a nice holiday coming up. Thanksgiving Day, right through Friday, right through the Iron Bowl on Saturday. The weather looks fine. Should be great. No weather issues whatsoever. Right now on the WVTM 13 Live Doppler, your most accurate look at current conditions. It is totally dry out there and will stay that way this evening. About 49 at 7 here in a few minutes, 45 at 9, 44 at 11. Technically speaking, tonight will not be as cold as last night, but you may not feel that much difference. I think you're still going to want a coat or a jacket this evening as it will be pretty chilly outside. All right, for the Iron Bowl, this forecast looks Perfect. I mean, just ideal weather. Kickoff temperature 65, falling down to 55. Just a few scattered clouds. Really no chance of rain worth mentioning. It looks like a very good day for football at Jordan Hare Stadium. We'll call it a 10% rain chance tomorrow, but that's kind of an average because over the eastern part of the state, I think the chance is more like 20 or 25% over the west, west of Interstate 65. It's probably zero. Then no chance Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. That includes Thanksgiving Day, the big shopping day afterward. We'll call it 10% on Saturday, but I wouldn't be surprised if we can and take that one down to zero at some point too. Taking you through the next couple days, we start off with clear skies in place, but then late tonight, some of this moisture starts drifting northwestward. At six o'clock in the morning, a few rain showers over Cleburne County, um, Randolph County too, down to Chambers County. They'll continue to move northwestward. They may just get as far west as Calhoun County or eastern Talladega County. Notice a cloud line, a very sharp one here, staying basically east of Interstate 65, and we think that will be the case. Then later on tomorrow afternoon, it gradually retreats into the state of Georgia. So just that chance there might be a few showers over the far eastern counties tomorrow. Otherwise, the dry weather pattern continues and will continue right through Wednesday too. that day, featuring a good supply of sunshine. My forecast for tonight, partly cloudy skies with most of the clouds over the east. Still very chilly, but not quite as cold. 39 degrees, your low temperature. 63 tomorrow, partly cloudy with that slight chance of a shower in the east. Otherwise, a little bit warmer than today was. Seven-day forecast. Wednesday should be sunshiny with 59 for the high. A great Thanksgiving, about 57 degrees. Friday and Saturday look good, too, with a little moderating trend. Then another cold snap comes here late in the weekend. And early next week, the low temperature Monday morning down into the upper 30s.